No, I honestly don't know. What is it about, bro? What, what could it possibly even be about? Uh, it's a catch up for the most part, so. I'm just gonna. Fuck. Hey, Randy, how's it going? I'll plug it in my headphones then on my phone. Oh, I'll stay alive, chat. I'm just gonna put my headphones in and listen to it while we're street while we're RPing. Okay. Okay. Fuck that, bro. Mm. Okay. Hold on, I gotta put my phone right. What the fuck you guys do in the middle of the fucking week, bro? You guys can do it on a fucking weekend? It's what everybody <laughs> voted on. The options weren't e I saw the voting. Well the options weren't even that fucking late. Best consume the oh I need that dongle. So is they gonna be there? That, I need a dongle. I need a dongle, okay? Okay, thank you. Alright, appreciate that, thank you. So is they gonna be there? Absolutely, you got it. All right. Bye bye. Never happened. All right. Where the fuck you been at, bro? I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. Uh on and off. You know, the, the past couple of weeks have been a bit rough. You know, hanging in there, Rami. Really? Life. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, things right? happen. Oh, I'm is okay. it the shit that you were talking to me about before? Mm hmm Oh man. So uh all right. Hope everything uh works out or if it hasn't, you know, uh, you know. Appreciate that, appreciate that. You know. All right. Uh all right, let's get started, okay? All right. Hear the good news or the bad news. Oh man. All right. Um okay. hmm. all right. so, just tell me how you wanted to tell me. Yeah. Talk, talk to me. Well, okay, so um, I spoke with the Senate, and I spoke with um, uh, Chief Justice Alan Crane. Okay. And um, as you know, there's been a legislation that's been pushed out regarding uh, weapon manufacturing and drug trafficking. You remember that? Yeah. The speedy court case? Correct. Uh, let me let me read to you exactly. Did you just grab the car yet? Um, yeah, I'm going up north. Fines and fines when it comes to the sentencing guideline. For drug trafficking, it's a minimum of three years in the penitentiary, three years of parole, and a 100K fine. Weapon manufacturing, 10 years in prison, 10 year parole, and oh a fine God. of 1 million, okay? 10 years, bro? Mm. Now, well, I mean, I'll be honest. My hands are tied behind my back. However, um, I can try to make a plea for you and the rest of the boys in exchange for a guilty plea. And that's where the plea deal comes in. You plead guilty to drug trafficking and weapon manufacturing, and we, I can try to meet you halfway or find some sort of deal that works for the both of us. That way, you know, both walk out of here. It's fair. I have that a question. Is, is weapons manufacturing uh, expungible? I don't know. I really I would like to keep my mayor hopes uh, alive someday. Maybe not. Maybe now or but. Maybe in like six months from now, I still would like to run. Felony, right? No, it's I don't, don't want to just completely write that off, you know? Yeah, it's not like murder or terrorism, so maybe? That's something you have to talk to DOJ about. Okay. All right, I'm, I'm, I, I think I can get around that, to be honest. No, okay. given the circumstances, so, how everything went so down. So right now, Rami, we're looking at 13 years in a penitentiary and Bro. a fine of 1.1 million. Okay? However, like I said... After speak with the Senate and the DOJ, I'm willing to offer you something that is, um, you know, along the sides of maybe 20 million and three years in a penitentiary. What would everybody else go? I'm starting with you. I'm asking if if I do this and plead guilty, my if I'm pleading guilty, what does everybody else get? Accomplice charges. Which is what? Slightly less than you. Slightly less than you. What does that mean? Pro it means that you get the highest and they get the second highest. That's not what I'm asking you. I'm asking you if, if I go to jail for, you know, years, and everybody else gets accomplice, what are they looking at? Are they looking at, you know, months? Or are they looking at... They're looking, everybody's looking at years, basically. Everybody's going to serve some years in the penitentiary, right? At least. What happened? You understand what I'm saying? If I plead guilty and I get 20 mil... And if they get, if they don't plead, if they, and they're looking at 10 mil, then I might as well just plead not guilty as well. You get what I'm saying? Like, what are, like. Well, you, so, so you pleading guilty will shave a lot of time. Um, and I'm willing to, you know, try to 
make the deal more favorable as far as the time, right? If you don't plead guilty, they'll go to court and they'll have to use the sentencing guidelines they have in, in the legislation. However, with um, the fact that we won't plead guilty and the fact that we come up with a plea deal, we can try to come up with um, new guidelines for the sentencing so we can provide you with something that is, you know, different. That, that wouldn't be by default if you go to court. Does that make any sense? If we go to court, my, and my hand's going to be tied. So okay. what basically the DOJ, whatever Speak is up, by the legislation. Way? Yeah, yeah. Can you hear me? Are you talking normally or are you, on, are you whispering? No, I'm actually shouting. Can you hear oh, me? Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, so, man. Okay, so, um, okay. So what, you're, you're willing to cut it down from 13 years and one and a half million to three years, 20 million. One. Correct. Unless you want to take more, I guess you want to take less time and more fine. Bro, 20 million? Who came up with that? That was Bass? I mean, uh, Crane? No, that was me. I spoke to Crane about, uh, you know, the sentencing guidelines. I have a question and for you. If I plead guilty to just the weapons manufacturing, what is it? Can I plead guilty to certain charges and not guilty to others? Uh, I mean, you can, then you would have to take it to court, obviously, right? Because, uh, so. because I, my question would be uh, the weapons, the drug manufacturing, the cocaine, you really can't prove that's mine. That's just found in a stash. Right. But you claim that was your property during the interview process, right? You claim that was your own. You even, you said that was my cocaine. Yeah. So, and then you have two. Bro, that cocaine intent, fucked me, bro. So the third one becomes an automatic drug trafficking. It's a three-star system, right? The third felony with intent. If you didn't have two other felony with intent, it would have been felony with intent. That would have been just, you know, months in jail and a fine. But because you had two felony intent in the past from previous meth runs and uh, weed, that's why you're getting uh, the third one being drug trafficking. Uh, I mean, is there any want... way somebody else can take the drug met the cocaine charge or, or that's not possible? It's not possible because you are the person that owns the property. It was found in your storage. Unless you can tell me who placed it inside there, then that person will take the fall. And if that another person takes the fall, that's never been caught with drug traffic or with meth before. It's still going to be drug trafficking because they transported it in there, Rami, right? Regardless how you spin it. It just didn't walk in there and just find itself in the storage, right? Somebody must have transported it in there and it's... Almost 3, Hypo hi hi hypothetically, frames. hypothetically, let's just speak hypothetics. If somebody else that was in the six admitted to them putting in that fucking meth, and they got an accomplice to weapons manufacturing, would what would their what, would their would their time and shit be similar to mine, or would it be still a lot less? Uh, everybody's getting, like, getting you're probably gonna get the most time and fine of all everybody. Everybody else will get less uh, time and fine. So you're gonna be the highest because you are the owner of VLC. And that's where the weapon bench was found along with um, the drugs. So you are going to, you're going to business that the bar so high. Everybody else will be there middle or lower. So for example, like, let's just do for an example. This is not, uh, obviously this is if everything goes through. Let's say you take three mil. I'm oh, sorry, sorry. 20 mil, three years. For example, kid would get like one year, 10 mil, right? Like for example, right? It wouldn't be close to what you're getting. It would be somewhere just near it. That's fucking stupid, child. I might as well just go to court. Fuck. Uh. You might think like that's probably what you're gonna offer everybody else. Yeah, I mean everybody else is gonna get a plea deal, right? It's up to them if they want to take it or not. And that is probably if gonna you be. Want, I could do more time in the penitentiary and less fine. We could do maybe instead of three years, we could do five and fifteen mil, for example, right? So, what is it you care about? Your fine or your time? What is it important to you? Uh, Randy wanted 10 years and 1 million. Okay. So everybody's going to be different depending on what kind of uh, deal they want to do. Randy's with trolling. There's no way he wants 10 years. He did. Honest to God, he said that to me. He's trolling. I got on a recording. Okay. Maybe he was, but I'm just telling you what he said. Um, uh, man, I'm not going to lie to you. I was hoping you would say one year, 20 mil. 
The reason why, because like I said, the weapon bench. Um, I'm giving you a year for drug trafficking and then, you know, two years for the weapon manufacturing. What if I don't have 20 million? Is that just net, net negative my account? Yep. You become broke. Bro. You become poor. And then you're down bad. Yo, chat, what do I do? Okay. Close um, your court, Rami. Shit, this side. Right. Um. Damn. What do you what do you, what do you advise? I would advise the um, what I just offered you right now. The three year twenty mil. That is the sweetest deal I can probably give you, honestly. I would take that deal and run away with it. Three years, 20 million? Unless you want five years, 50 mil. Those two, those, ah, uh, man. Uh, yeah, it's just like, do I really want to go negative $10 million, you know? Yeah, I mean, the amount of shit that we found in the gallery and the weapon bench and everything, you know, it, it's a heavy fine. It's a very, very heavy fine. Is your ATM? Me. We just see, like, how much I have total, like, that would, like, you know what I'm saying? Sure. I mean, we did, uh, subpoena your, uh, DLC. Hey, Why did you pull out three million? When? The day before it happened. Uh, I, to be honest with you, I don't even know. It was on December 1st, you pulled out three million. Was the, was there a note? No, no. Uh, probably for a car or some shit. Oh, I, I had to, Miguel, I owed, Miguel needed three million dollars to, uh, Alone? Yeah. Uh, I'm literally gonna be negative nine million dollars. Call me a rum, an entrepreneur. You got an enterprise VLC. I heard the Diamond Sportsbook is doing pretty well, Rami. You'll be fine. Yeah, but I also need to leave some money in there to fucking pay the employees, you know? Maybe you gotta go out of business. Sell some of your shares. Pull on Elon Musk. Sell part of your shares for uh, Tesla. Or or whatever like enterprise you got going on. Alright, um. All right, let's go back inside. Damn, bro. You really think I should do the 3 million? Three years, 20 mil? I mean, I would take that. I would honestly take that. It's really up to you. What is your current more about? Your time or your money? Well, if I can't even afford anything when I get out, bro, then what the fuck is the point of having everything, you know? Can I give, a, can I give an asset? Uh, you can't give an asset? That's something you have to talk to DOJ about now. So, Rom, it's not your first, first time being, you know, down bad or broke, okay? You yeah, but no, this point. is a whole nother level, bro. Uh, who do I need to talk to to give an asset? Uh, probably the DOJ would have to be part of the plea deal. We can write it down. Uh, what if I offered you an $8 million plane? What? You have that? Yeah. Okay, well... Um, it's, a boat, gonna, it's a boat, plane, and helicopter all in one. What am I going to do with that plane? I don't know. Use it for whatever you guys need to use it for. Why don't you fucking sell it? Because nobody has $8 million to buy a plane. How did you get a million dollars to buy the plane in the first place? Through the money. I wasn't spending it, so I bought a fucking plane. Mm. Yeah, yeah, let me know if I can give an asset. Or, like, how do I go about that? Uh, I'd have to talk to Crane and ask him if we can do something like that. Yeah, ask him and then let me know. Let me, when do you need it? You need answered right now, by the way, for this? Probably sooner the better. All right. Is he around? I believe so. Is this on the DOJ app? He is. Hey, Kirk, can I be a Mishra PD? All right, I'll see you soon. Right, I'm going to have him come down here so I can probably explain the process better than I do because um, 
At the end of the day, the dealer just got to sign off on it, Rami. All right, I can tell you three uh, euros, 20 mil, and Crane can look and say, you know what? No, I want more time. So uh, at the end of the day, there has to be some sort of, uh, I guess, uh, beneficiary of the DOJ being there to kind of sign off on it and say, hey, uh, we agree with this uh, plea deal. But that's what I'm thinking uh, based on everything. I think um, I wanted to go heavy on the fine and less my time because of the circumstances of what happened at the gallery. Wait, you say that again? I said I wanted to go heavy on the fine and less on the time because of the circumstances of what happened in the gallery. And nobody's ever been charged with weapon Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are so. set a precedent. This for, I get it. So. Mm, all right yeah let me know if i could uh damn i really i didn't want to do three years bro but fuck it would you want to do more years no i wanted to do less years but uh that's fine three years 20 mil is understandable it's going to clock i'll wake up for three days finally bitch he's been around you haven't been around you sure yes uh okay um yeah let me know let me know uh, is he come down He's coming down right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's coming down right now. Damn, bro. Yes, yeah, you'll be fine. I'm sure you'll make that money back pretty quick. Don't you have like a Bugatti? Yeah, I'm not giving that up. Is that one on one? Yeah. What else do you have? What kind of cars do you have to use? Well, actually, let me look. I can probably look here. Brabham, Bugatti. I have the plane. I thought you sold the Bram to uh, Jalen. No, Flippy. Flippy's driving it, but he's not around. Oh, R.I.P. Yeah, I'll be back. You have a Mustang? Yep, 1965 uh, classic. Classic, classic. DLC, DLC Imports has a lot of money, though, Rami. Doesn't that like, what, four or five million there, right? Uh, I moved it because I didn't trust Kevin Ram. I thought he was going to take it all away before I fired him. So I moved it all my personal. Damn. Yep. I, what was Kevin Ram to you? Was he the CEO or the CFO? Uh, one what of my best he? friends, to be honest. Why would he abandon you and John Gulag gang? I don't understand. Because he's a fucking idiot. He's, hard? he's a fucking idiot. Is that an idiot or is he a snake? Which one is it? Both. Why would he betray you? I don't understand. Hey, he's a dumbass. Come on, Rami. Something must have happened, okay? Nothing literally happened, bro. Trust me, bro. You can go. I... You're telling me he just woke up the next Look, day. And I swear what? to you, Wallahi, that's what happened. He was bored because he wanted to do crime. He didn't. I'll be honest. He wanted to do crime. You know, he was bored of just doing business shit. Okay, that makes more sense. But Why I told him Gula exactly. Gang? Like members. Exactly. I was. Like, I told him. I was like, Yo, you think you're gonna be on the shootouts with fucking, you know, Ming, fucking Turk, Gaspacho, and uh, Jack, and Marty? He's gonna work the fucking pumps at the gas uh, station. That's li what literally, that's what I. That's what we told him. He doesn't get it. He's an idiot. You know, some people just don't know how good they have it till they lose it. Yep. Exactly. That's what Hutch was saying. He said he thinks the grass is greener on that side, but he's going to get a hard awakening. Kay, told him, way, Kay told him the heart the best. He said you, you'll get a heart rude awakening when you're sitting there uh, pumping gas and on the sidelines on the radio hearing them do, do the jobs. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Just, uh, I wish more people would just make their own path instead of, uh, you know, constantly follow the... Yeah, and that, Kay said the same shit. He was like, bro, if you want to have fun in it, you got to have fun when you're grow growing into it. Don't join something that's already established. Exactly. That's what uh, that's what Kay was saying. He just doesn't get it, bro. He doesn't get it. Crazy. Even the chief of fucking police knows. Or the sorry, the commissioner, the commissioner of the entire police department. I've seen it. I've seen it. Hey, Crane. Um, downstairs in the interview rooms. You have keys to the Mr. P, right? Okay. Sounds good. Man. Yeah, that really got me sad. I'm not gonna lie. A fucking nigga, Kevin Ram shit. How long you known Kevin Ram for? I gave him everything, bro. He was started from nothing. Damn. What's up, uh, Crane? Hello. Uh, I'm just uh, you know, realizing how poor I am. What else? Uh, so is Rami. So is Rami. So Crane, um, after everything we talked about and doing the plea deals, I explained to Rami first of all that based on the current legislation that we have right now, made by the Senate, and you. Uh, the sentence guidelines for weapon manufacturing is 10 years, 10 parole, and 1 million uh, fine, along with um, drug trafficking being three years. Uh, w no, is it three years? Yeah, three years, three years of parole, and 100K as a fine. However, if we can get some sort of plea deal going, um, we're willing to kind of just um, 
come up with um, a, a special plea deal to where, uh, you know, we can make it work for this uh, circumstance that happened in the gallery. And uh, I propose um, three years, 20 mil for Romney. How do you feel about that? Is that something we can do? Uh, so you want to you wanna break the minimum? I want to break the minimum, but hit him harder at the fine. I want to go really high on the fine and then break the minimum as far as the years in the penitentiary. Uh, I mean, you know, uh, I've been empowered by the Senate to negotiate on their behalf, so uh, they do have the absolute right at their discretion to break the minimums if they feel so necessary. And I, you know, based on the, like I just talked about, realizing how poor I am, it does seem <laughs> to me that uh, there is a lot more money out there than I ever realized. Um, so I do think there is an impetus to go after, you know, assets and finances. Um, so I, I could be open to it. What's uh, Mr. Okay. Rahman's uh, perspective? So Ryan wants to offer also some assets in exchange for maybe a lower fine. Is that something we can do within the plea deal? What, uh, what assets? I have a one of one 1963 Cold War slash World War II Tula uh, bomber plane that is a three in one plane, boat, and uh, helicopter. That's a one of one. I got it for $8 How million. Did you get that? I have a collector. I know a collector. Mm. You know what I mean? I see. Okay. Got it for $8 million. Is that another word for it was a heist and we stole it? No, another word for Dean Watson. <laughs> mm. and you could provide proof of the amount of money you spent on this item yes i can okay so you'd be wanting to you'd be wanting to what pay us 12 cash and eight for the the thing essentially yes uh we could we could consider that I think that's something uh, I could I could bring to them for sign off. Um, uh, to be yeah, honest, I you, I, I just don't want to go do three years in jail and then come out to negative ten million in the fucking bank or nine million in the bank or whatever the fuck it is. Uh, and then yeah, I understand. I understand. Yeah, tell me about it. I uh, I found out today that one car, or not even like a one on one, just one you know really good car costs more than all the money combined that Hydra got fined for murdering a cop. Holy shit, that's crazy. When you put it like that, it really does change the perspective around. Yeah, I got told that a GTR wide body is like anywhere between five and eight million dollars. Hydra only Christ. paid like 6.25 once we seized the G-Wagon. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm amicable to taking assets because I think that's where the game's at. I don't want to do five five. Should I do? Everybody shuffling things no? around. What's up? Do I sound better now? By the way, or no? Yeah, yeah. I feel like you were a little low before. Okay, okay. Right. Uh, what uh, what about the other chuckle fucks? What's the what's the outlook on everybody else? Uh, I haven't spoken to anybody else. So I was going to start with Rami because he had the most charges and uh, the the main charges of what happened in the DLC. I was going to start with Rami, then set that as kind of like the. Um, uh, the bar that we're looking for right. and then go from there and then just once we get that deal with Rami going that way we can have some sort of standard like if he wants to adjust it and he wants to make it you know 3 and 12 in the car uh, plane whatever it is uh, as long as he can show a bank transaction where he actually paid that yeah, much money I, I for do. it okay then uh, yeah I'd be open to it I, I'd at least feel pretty good about recommending it to the Senate you know it's their final call uh, but they'll probably take my input pretty seriously. And so was that I, offer still stand it. for five million, or for five years? I'm sorry. What's the other deal? Yeah. Was? I, was I, was do, yeah. I was into five years, fifteen million. Five and fifteen. What's the proportionality on that? Two and a half mil per day. Mm hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, how, however you want to slice it, uh, however you want to, you know, figure it all out, that's good with me. Um, I think, uh, I think, I think the minimum should be three years, though. I don't think we should go lower than that. Um, I'm, I'm willing to, you know, work a deal, but I think if a day one drug trafficker off the street is getting three years as a minimum, I think you should at least get. No, no, hundred percent. I'm not arguing that. Yeah. Okay. Well. uh, 
Y'all let me know what you want to go to. I actually got to deal with a conference call right now in my house. Um, but I'll be back around another like 30 minutes if y'all come up with anything else. Yeah, okay. yeah. We were just wondering if we can use the asset boost, so I guess we can, right? Yes. Right. Uh, if, if you know, everything checks out and, you know, you've assured me it is, yeah. um, that's something we can consider. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, All righty. Well, well, let's figure out, Rami, what is it you want to put on the table? I'll get though? back with y'all in a bit. I would put that, to, the, it's called a Tula. Um, okay, so it's an $8 million plan, right? Yeah. And then... Okay. Um, and which deal are you taking, the three or the five? I don't know. I have to, like, I need to figure out, like... You know what I want to decide today, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can take 24 hours. Yeah, I I give the $8 million plane and then, yeah. And then I figure out if I want to do 15 mil or 20 mil for two days, for two years. I mean, yo, what do I have to figure this out by? Um, man, we got, we got 50 days. I, I, I I essentially, I would want to turn myself in on like a weekend. Like, I'm like, uh, I mean, I leave on. I leave for a trip on Saturday, so I would prefer if it was done before Saturday. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll have your. Uh, oh, really? I say by Thursday. By Thursday, is that good enough time for you? Uh, not really. When do you come back? Uh, Tuesday, next Tuesday. I'll be gone for three days. You want to do it before sure. you leave, or is there you cool to do it after you come back? The sooner the better, obviously. Yeah. Uh, I mean, whatever works for you guys, uh, I'm not in a rush. We still got 59. Yeah, I would either do it. I'm debating either this week or next week. And it's, you know, I want to, I, I got to see what I got, you know? Um, okay, yeah, let me figure some shit out and then I'll let you know. I'll let All you right. know by tomorrow, probably. So, like we said, f- five years, 15 million. Three yeah. years, 20 million. Yep. And then the, the fine can get lower depending on what kind of assets you're willing to, um, you know, offer. Yeah, so, I would give the, uh, the plane. If you do, that would be three years, 12 million. And then it would be five years, seven, uh, seven million. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yep. That works. All right. Good, good, good talking to you, boss. Likewise. I'll walk you out. All right. Vinny's still around, right? Yep. Okay, five million, five years, seven million, Chad. I mean, I'm I'm still up a million, and then I don't got to take money out of the businesses. All right, Bass. You have a good night, all right? You too. I'll spice you out there. I'll see you on the meth run, right?